Kumaran hai, is standing by now. Let's ask him what are the uh, stocks uh, back home to keep on our radar in today's session. Pranay? Yes, uh, Karuni, if you look at Bharti Infratel, then over the weekend you've seen the NCLT Nord coming in to merge in the towers with Bharti Infratel. And uh, this was expected, so uh, uh, just completion of the deal earlier. If you look at Vedanta, then uh, it is seeking arbitration in this uh, Zambian copper mine dispute. As you're well aware, they've had to uh, shut down uh, the mine over there and also suspend production because of government action, uh, which has uh, been rather abrupt and therefore they are uh, trying to resolve it through dialogue but they believe that this will take some time and are seeking some arbitration to resolve it as soon as possible. Jet Airways, uh, as per reports, uh, will remain in focus uh, because the lenders are uh, currently reluctant to take a haircut. There is still uh, some hope uh, that in, in due course of time, uh, based on a couple of prospective investors who had shown interest, maybe uh, the two or three of them can come together to pick up a stake. That hasn't materialized yet. Uh, but as of now, the lenders aren't willing to take a haircut uh, or provide uh, more when it comes to uh, provisions from their profits. If you look at GE Shipping, then the board has approved a 100 crore uh, buyback over the weekend. Uh, Tata Steel, uh, its arm Tata Steel BSL has implemented the resolution plan for Bushnell Energy which was uh, acquired a few months back and uh, in bulk deals you had Indian terrain fashions where uh, a fund has sold about 4 point, uh, has bought about 4.09 lakh shares and this quantity was actually sold by Amundi Funds India Select uh, which is a mid cap focused fund.